just hanging out, just having fun. We're number one. Whoa. I'm a dip, he's a dip, she's a dip. We're all just a. I'm a dip, he's a dip, she's a dip. We're all just a. I'd recommend Lucas uh, to any club. Um, Notice that the first night he came to training, and I think, I think if he if he wants it badly enough, and he's determined to do it, I think he could do it. I think he could surprise a lot of people. Um, saying that is going to take a lot of hard work, and I'm I'm sure he's ready for it. I'm sure he's up to it. He doesn't mind hard work, so. He could do it, yeah, if he wants, if he wants it. I think he's worth giving a go. Uh, he's got potential that um, uh, he has got it. He, he can, he can do it. I think he could do it. Taking clear in the park, very, very gifted. Very fit, he runs all day. Get, well, you're gonna get 100% every time. What you've got to get is with good quality players. Uh, and just keep it simple. There's a couple of positions you could, you could play, holding midfield players, because he's got the technical ability and he's strong. I know he's not got much of a frame on him now, but he'll develop, That's, that'll come. But he's, got the, but he's got the intelligence here to get that ball and play the ball simply. But the also thing you can have him is playing with the two central midfielders and allowing him to get forward, because he's got the stamina to go penalty box to penalty box, and he can do it all day. And to me, that's uh, a big asset you've got. Well, Lucas is a, he's a he's pretty tall player and he plays in the midfield. He's, he's got a lot of skill uh, for being a tall player. He's a good passer of the ball and his work rate is very good. Uh, his endurance and stamina, you know, he's, he's a good box-to-box -box midfielder. He's one of the best players at the Australian Football School, by, by far. And the most important thing that he has the ability to read the game. He's always one step or two steps ahead. And this, I think, is a big thing uh, for a footballer because it will help a lot his, dis uh, his decision making. And at an elite level, it's uh, not just about skills and technique, it's about the quick of thought and the speed of the decision making that is taken. And if he keeps doing what he's doing, he's gonna be a good, good player.